it's a Britney and today's video I'm so excited about because we are playing one of my favorite paranormal games ever. It's a classic on my channel, the hosting game. So I wanted to make it different and you guys have been asking me to do this for since the first time that I actually played the hosting game. You guys want me to do this with other paranormal games as well, but you guys wanted me to use my spirit box while I play this game. So I thought the hosting game was a very perfect fit for my spirit box to come in. Do I think that I am going to communicate with spirits or demons while playing this game? I truly don't think so, but this is something that I've been wanting to do and what you guys want me to do as well to see. But the hosting game, you know, like I always say when I play my games on my channel, that yes, you always have to be cautious. You should be cautious, but majority of these games, rituals, I believe that they're just for fun. They're harmless. But there is always that possibility of bringing something in. I think if you're doing a crazy satanic game ritual where you're like selling your soul to the devil himself, or you know, you're trying, you're calling on all of these demons, yes, that makes a bigger risk for you to bring something bad in. But you know, Bloody Mary and stuff, I mean, everybody knows nothing happens. That's just a fun ritual to play with your friends. I enjoy playing that game. You guys know that. I freaking love Bloody Mary. She's my favorite urban legend. But I just want you guys, like, I'm always straight up about it. And, you know, I think this is a very interesting way to play the game. It's a way to amp it up. And I just think it's really cool. But if, you know, I do you know, get some voices or something talks to me, of course I think that's crazy. Is it really a spirit or a demon? I can't prove it to you. You know, it's all about what I believe. I truly believe in all this. You guys know that and I know you guys do too because you wouldn't be subscribed to me if you didn't or maybe some of you are skeptics. I don't know. I've never really come across a skeptic on my channel. I don't think so. So I'm going to leave all of my hosting game videos down below because there's a lot of them, you know, explaining how to play this game and just the different rounds that I did. So I don't want to take up too much time, but I have it on my phone too. So it says the hosting game is a scary paranormal ghost game. The object of the game is to summon three ghosts. Gonna bring my spirit box, my matches are over there and I will see you guys in a second. Bye. <sighs> All right, guys, so I am in my hosting room. Sorry, this flashlight's kinda, okay. <laughs> so I have to write on my piece of paper, you are invited to a gathering hosted by Brittany. It takes place at 12.22 a.m. Bring your friends. So I have to do that in here. Hold on, it's kind of difficult for me to do. So you won't see me for a second because I need the flashlight on my piece of paper. You are invited to a gathering hosted by Brittany. Then what did I say? <laughs> I forget. Oh, okay. By Brittany, it takes place Bring your friends. Okay. Bring your friends. And then I gotta stand in the doorway, facing into the hosting room and say, I am ready, you may come in. I am ready, you may come in. Okay guys, I'm gonna grab my three matches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three. Those are my three matches, none of them lit. That means I have three uninvited guests, bad guests, that are here. So I got my spirit box going, as you can hear it. Are there any spirits with me right now? 
Are there any bad spirits here? Are there any demons in here that would like to speak with me? Are there three uninvited guests with me right now? Does anybody want to speak with me? So I tried to light my three matches, which did not work out, and that means I have three uninvited guests. I would really appreciate if the three uninvited guests would speak with me, please, through the spirit box. I would appreciate it. I want to know why you're here. Even though I played the game, that's why they're here. Can you please tell me why you're here? Okay, you guys, so I just turned off my spirit box. I hope you can see me okay. This flashlight isn't really the greatest, and usually I have a candle with me when I play this game, but I wanted to do it kind of different this time. I need my night vision camera. I know people are like, you gotta get night vision. I know, I really do. But, um, so that is the end of this game. I mean, it's so different. If you watch my first one, I was freaking out when I was playing it. Here, I'll get closer to you guys. I think if I'm closer, yeah, there we go. And then you can kind of see my face more. I think that's better. Okay, so if you look at the difference from when I played this game for the first time, I totally freaked myself out. There was the, that weird <laughs> thumping sound that I heard. It was so weird and you know, I'm not surprised that I didn't hear anything through my spirit box, but you know, I find a lot of stuff when I do spirit box sessions when I'm in editing. I hear stuff that I didn't hear in person, so I could have picked up on something. Sorry guys. To be honest, I don't think I did. I didn't hear anything. I mean, if something does come across while I'm going over my footage, then heck yes, I will put it in. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like I said, I'm going to leave all of my hosting game videos down below, so if you want to check them out. Um, I thought the spirit box was a really cool thing to bring in, like I've said so many times in this video, but um, I'm not surprised with the outcome. I'm not surprised at all. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. Thank you so much for watching. As always, you rock my world in the song lyrics of Michael Jackson. Hashtag team pretty 44. Hashtag Barilla runs. Hey! And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! Okay, so I think I should end this game. So, thank you for coming. Goodbye.